ED Corp Makan Battery Ke? You know, we get a lot of comments on our socials, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and YouTube about EVs, and a lot of people have the misunderstanding that EVs are not efficient during traffic jams. Well, to prove it, let's put it to the test. You see, it's scorching hot right now, and uh, it's 11.33 p.m., and the BYD CO Premium is right now at 47% battery left. You see here, 36 degree, and the aircon is really blasting right now, and that's why it's 3 kilowatts. It's a bit higher than average. So let's just see how much battery do we use after one hour. And almost half an hour in, we only dropped 1%. And the aircon is still blasting right now. It's super hot outside. You know, we just set to 23 degrees. And the aircon is actually blasting right now. Pretty comfortable in here. And this car comes with a glass roof. But luckily, BYD has provided a sunshade so that it can actually help to cut down heat from coming into the cabin. And yes, this car also comes with ventilated seats. So the seats are pretty cool with cold air coming up from here. I'm a bit hungry and thirsty right now. Let's do something. The BYD seal also comes with V2L capability and that means you can use this EV as a power bank to power home appliances. Alright, let's hook up a kettle and an air fryer. The V2L feature was disabled when you tried to turn on the kettle at the same time so we got to wait for this to finish cooking then we're going to turn on the kettle. I think the power output is a bit too high. Alright, nuggets done. Time to boil the water. So we fried nuggets and boil water for coffee and total discharge is 1.2 kilowatt hour. Not too bad. And we still have 44% battery remaining, pretty nice. After one hour, the battery dropped to 42%. So 47 to 42%, about 5%. And exactly one hour, 2.33 p.m. So based on this experiment, this car only loses 5% of battery in this extreme test per hour. So that means you can leave this car idling for more than 20 hours, no problem. And this is the BYD Seal Premium.